Okay. Um, I think it's like the... It's been two days since I last recorded, so... Not super... Uh, I don't remember everything <laughs> that's happened. But, uh, I do know... I was testing, so I tried to get the resolution up a little bit. So hopefully things look a little bit better. I was noticing some things looked a bit blurry. Uh, let me go here and adjust some stuff. Uh, I, I tried doing Citrus Spin, but... For, uh... WP is kind of expensive. I don't want a free WP move with a uh, lint. I think we will go for um, okay, paper cut and then cinder spin. I know I just said it's expensive, but getting that type of advantage I think is pretty good. And it slows enemies, which, in my opinion, it does weird stuff. I don't know if it's supposed to do necessarily what it's supposed to do. And I think once I get enough uh, SP, I'll probably rank up. Uh, maybe Cautionary Tale, just because I haven't inflicted sleep on enemies yet, so. Also, let me look at Yagi real quick as well. Karate Chop is fine. Uh, Astral Projection is fine. Inferno. And I think that's okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what's going on over here. Also, the music, I just noticed, is very ominous. What do you, you two have to say? Thank the gods for the challenges. Right? We needn't have worried. Yeah, there's no way Yagi will make it through. Oh yeah? Say that to my face! Haha, <laughs> okay, that was pretty funny, Yagi. If the witch challenge is stand-up comedy, you might still have a chance. Oh, that's the shui. <laughs> I, I thought Yagi had a good comeback for once. If the wit challenge is stand-up comedy, you might still have a chance. Anything else? Okay. What are they going to be in battle? Because I assume we're going to fight them, hopefully. Oh, I don't think I was supposed to do that. I didn't see... Oh, there were stairs. I'm dumb. Oops. Just making sure I'm not missing anything going in the, the correct way. So I don't think the monks expected me to just fall down like that. What do you get to say? I'm not supposed to compete. I have to restart my monk training. But I couldn't resist the challenge. I don't care if there are consequences. I want to fight. Can we fight you? I wouldn't mind fighting you. Also, I hear a salamander. Ugh, not observation tests. I didn't bring my glasses. It's kind of dark in here. Uh, this reminds me of the Badger Mines. That didn't go so well. Oh yeah. Good memories. For me, not for Pepper. I think they were trying to do, like, some terrorist activities. If I remember correctly. There we go, I got the first strike. Ooh, new battle music. Oh, it was that bell guy, the Despicable. Uh, no, we'll keep Yagi. I'll do... Let's do Fish Hammer. Oh, I got rid of that guy. Thankfully, they're all pretty weak to this. So I could do this that has a chance to slow, and then... We'll do this one at least. That's cool. I didn't know it affected multiple people. I think I used it in the fight with uh, Kakoi. The one weird thing is the slow there allows his double hit attack to go like one after another. So it's like weird uh, or behaviors that happen when you slow an enemy. Also, I wanted to show chat because I realized I haven't been showing this as much. And there is some like crazy stuff the chat says sometimes. I think I actually saw like a vine sauce reference once because it said Vinny sauce. Yeah. Okay. Um. Let's go for the Spigable doesn't have a, a resistance to anything, but I don't have any psychic moves. I'm gonna go for meteoric knife because I want to get more experience with this move. Oh man. <laughs> exactly why. Go for this again. I 
So I think it'll make it when I edit stuff. I could look at the chat when I'm editing. Because I'm not really paying too much attention to chat stuff. Oh, now it uses RP. Yeah. I don't remember if there's anywhere in the game that it says RP gets used up if you don't have sufficient uh, WP. I feel like it did somewhere in the early game, but I only know that because of the uh, demo that was on HIO. I remember they specified that there, at least. I mean, speaking of uh, WP, let me see if I have something that heals. There's that one, but that one's kind of good. Mm. Maybe I should be using RP more then. If I have more things that heal RP. Ooh, we can use a uh, Lint here. Ooh. Guessing there's a lizard in here? I, I hear one, but... Oh, yeah, I see him right there. Man, this place looks pretty cool. I like the wooden banisters, and then just the uh, marble floor, or some sort of like stone floor that's so shiny you can see reflections in it. That is so cool. Also, the use of bamboo as well. I would like to grab grow bamboo, because I think it can grow where I live. It's more of a desert area, but I mean, bamboo, one, it's pretty resilient, but also you have to be careful about growing bamboo, because it can be pretty invasive for how easy it grows. So you need to be careful that it doesn't spread to stuff, because it can be bad for the environment if it grows in a place that's not well kept. <laughs> Where's the old man? I want the old man. I wonder if that's talking about uh, Papa Baker. Yeah, it still does that weird special thing. I wonder if that's because I have it so that my partner's first, so it doesn't check that. Uh, let's go for a cliffhanger. It's probably not going to kill because I think they resist. Because it's like a sword move. Yeah, they're going to resist. It'd be nice if Lofa had a multi-hit move. Oh, I'm pretty low on HP. Or maybe I can use that uh, Momo thing. Where is it? The Momo. And I get more healing out of it too because of that Corbne boon. <laughs> Dub is just sitting there. Someone to put that in the chat. Do you, I wonder... I don't think they do, but that'd be kind of cool if you could have like Twitch integration with this game. So it gets rid of this game's chat and then just lets you have uh, your own chat. That'd be kind of cool. Okay, we'll just go for... Wait, Cinder Spin hits everybody, right? It does. I don't think it's going to kill the bell, but we'll have uh, Loaf kill the bell. Oh, it does one damage. And see... <laughs> okay, that was so weird. <laughs> yeah, slowing enemies is not that good. I don't know what they should do to fix that. Um, I'll go for, let me try Rose, that way I can get better at this. Okay. So what I realized is once it gets to the very top, you can hold it for a while. I thought it would go at the same rate as when you press it up normal, or when you press the button and it goes up, it doesn't go to the same rate when it's at the tippy top, so we got some leeway there. Oh, it actually does zero damage. You mess that up. Well, thankfully I have roast then, because I probably would die. <laughs> yeah, slow is such a, it's actually a bad status. It's funny if you want to see some jank stuff, but yeah, I don't recommend it. They should just make it so that, um, if they have multi-hit moves, it reduces it by one or something. Uh, I'm just gonna use the WP and then just do this move. Because this will kill. Got 
got the level up, so that's good. I think... Maybe go for the HP, since I'm taking so much damage. Increase our backpack slot. That way, Loaf has more options available to him. Um, oh yeah, I was talking about bamboo. Yeah, bamboo is cool. I think of how fast it grows is pretty crazy. Also in that you can just use it like wood. It's also awesome as well. Oh, got sneak attacked. Switch to Yagi. He's more suited for this environment. Um, I think I will use roast again. Yeah, I do have to let go, so I can't just hold it. Go for distortion again. Oh, I just missed. Or I was just close to messing it up. I see that they miss sometimes. I don't know if that's... I don't think I have a boon that makes them miss. I wonder what's causing that. That looks really cool. Super satisfying. It's like in Smash Bros, when uh, you have a really strong move, it just continues, or the duration of the move still goes out. The only thing I can think of immediately, top of my head, is probably like Banjo's Wonder Wing. Oh, I didn't think I was gonna make that jump. Uh, because since you're invincible when you use it, you can just kind of go through attacks, and it extends it. Okay, so there was a secret here. That's cool. Focus reduces the party's will consumption by... Ooh! That's really good. Um, so let's get rid of one of these crowd pleasers. Buddy else is kind of cool if you want, like, a tanky, uh, partner. Cool. I just realized my cursor's on the screen. <laughs> Oops. There you go. Sorry if that was annoying, guys. I didn't even realize that. Oof. Because yeah, usually when I play in the... Because I'm playing uh, with the Steam Deck, but I'm playing it in desktop mode. Because uh, I think it can get better resolution that way. I wonder if there's a puzzle here. Like, you gotta... Select a certain one. Oh, this is this guy. I don't think I first striked. Um, yeah, sorry about the cursor thing. That would bother me if I saw it. If only fake chat told me about it. Yay. Oh, that guy's weak to app or not apple food. That's a cool attack animation. Okay, well since he's weak to that, I'll just use this. Ah, oh, I messed it up. Uh, he might resist it, too. Oh, it's just the bell now. I think now the fighting is... A feels a little bit better now that I'm like understanding a little bit more and just keep having the options. But once you are in the beginning, it's kind of bare bones because I mean you really don't have much. Ooh, guitar. Give me the guitar. I feel like there's something we gotta do there. But yeah, now now it feels a little bit better getting a hang of it. So, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to go that way? I think I got him that time. Yeah, I did. 
I wonder if he could change the item that used to whack in the overworld. Because starting with ladle is kind of lame. Let's go with saving sword. Okay, so I need to hit the Despicable back. Am I allowed to, um... I can use this. Okay, that should be enough to finish it off. Let's see you use RP here. Cool, we level up again. I do feel like you level up a little too much. Like the enemy XP in this game feels kind of inconsistent. Um, should I increase will? Should I just see or er, resolve or will? Hmm. Go for resolve, I guess. Now we can increase that pat back slot. Let me see if I can change the. Weapon thing here. It seems like Ladle is stuck, but maybe I'll get different things to switch at later. Okay, so let me put this here. That means I can put Meteoric Knife there. And then the only thing that's left is Kitchen Knife. Oops. Mm, I think that's fine for now, though. I could swap this out here. That'd be cool if I could switch it out for the ladle, but... Nope. Um... Yeah, I'll take it... Oh, maybe there is an enemy that's weak to, uh... I think it's called Hash? Oh, it's Piper. Probably doesn't want me talking to him though. Considering the last episode, he told us that number one would get mad at him. These challenges should be easy enough. It's the combat I'm worried about. What am I saying? I can do this. Come on. Okay. What's Axel's got to say? Do your best, little guys. Don't worry. When you fail a test, they still let you watch the final matches. Cheer for me in the finals, yeah? So we definitely need Yagi here. Do you think Yagi? I think there's something down here. I heard a, a salamander sleeping or snoring. Oh, it's on top. How do I get on top? Do I do th this? Oh, yeah, you do. Well, that is a way to do it. I don't know if it is the way to do it. How do we get in this chest? Ooh. Flame whip. An ornate golden whip emanating an otherworldly warmth. The gin goes it belongs to a great piece that went hiding into the west. Hmm. Is that something I can use? Ooh, flame whip. Wait, does that mean it hits everybody? Ah, oh, yes. So you gotta think how I want to use this. Oops, I tried uh, rotating it. For some reason I think RT is to rotate, but it's a uh, Y. Okay, let's do that. Get fish hammer. Okay, so saving sword. And then I guess the knife. I guess that's fine, because kitchen knife 
is the same as the shish kebab. I think the only difference is the uh, one's a sword and one's a piercing, I think. I wanted the bow, but it's a little exp expensive on size-wise. Now we use these guys to get back up. Well, that's cool, though. Not now uh, he's got a multi-hit attack. And it's fire, too, which is great. I guess I have to do it here? I thought since they had the platform there, it'd be all good for me, but it's not. Do your thing, Yagi. That was a nice little sidetrack there. A good thing I, I increased uh, the shape. I think I'm gonna rank up my backpack again. I wish there was a thing that you can increase the, uh, the size of your inventory too, but I think those are upgrades that you get along the way in terms of the like, quests and stuff. So let's see. Let's try this flame with. Keep the cursor in the center. Is this like... Okay, it's like the Nuppo. Oh, it happens twice. Cool. That's really nice. I think I'm going to change Loaf back to his regular costume, though. Wow, that did barely any damage. I wonder if the spigot bells have defense. I never really thought to think about that. Oh, it puts them to sleep? Did I not notice that? Maybe you have to get it perfect. Also, this is my first time seeing an enemy at, in sleep. I think it's funny that they just put that up. Uh, little purple bar over their eyes. Did I not notice that before? I saw projection. Why did I put them to sleep? Is this st is this status supposed to be sleep? That might be a bug on their part. Maybe they inputted the data wrong for that. That's weird. If I knew that move put people to sleep, maybe I would have used it a lot more. Oh, you know where's Jester? Isn't he supposed to be with Klein? What's he doing over here? Terrorizing this little lapwing? Come on, Burbrain. Move it or lose it, eh? I'm just recentering Koo. Oh. Well, go set her in someplace else, eh? Some of us have winning to do. What is the mask supposed to be? Like a bunny or something? I thought it was like one of those Japanese masks that has you like pouting your lips out. I don't think that's what it is. Please stop yelling. That's it. Whoa. Oh, there goes his mask. That's... Or how does the link go? That's Jester's crony. Hey, the name's Klein, not crony. Aw, oh, nuts. My mask fell off, huh? Hey, look over there. Huh? So, that was one of the bad guys you mentioned earlier. Yeah, he must be up to something. <laughs> well, we always gotta go for the pun. Oh, they didn't even acknowledge it. <laughs> this Jester guy sounds like a lot of trouble. You guys really need to fill me in on the details on this quest. Oh, right. Let's do that on the way down this on the way downstairs. See, they had them all three out there. Like what the heck was happening before, man? <laughs> if they do patches, I think they need to uh patch all the scenes where they uh swap in and out. They just need to fix that and just have them all be out. It just feels better. Narrative in a narrative sense to just have them all out. Because if you really want me to care about these characters, you gotta have them um, interacting like that. Let's see, what did I pick up? A mochi ice cream. I wonder if you get this later on. Because I'm guessing there's a snow area because of that one Swedish 
podcaster guy. Dub. Again, uh, you know what I noticed? It doesn't save the colors. Um, you know, speaking colors. Weird. It, it saves, uh, Loaf's colors. And it saves Lint's, right? Yeah, it saves Lint's. But it doesn't save any for Yagi. Or Dub. Though I think I like Lint's. I think it makes his, uh, skin tone darker, too. Whoops. I think I got rid of, uh, I'll say. Let's see. Yeah, he's like a more yellow or brown. And then he's like a darker brown, yeah. I like that color. Although the other one is good too. You know what, if I'm going to <laughs> be doing that, might as well just change it back for a bit. But I will save. <laughs> That's what I was trying to do before, but I got sidetracked that. Uh, dub wasn't changed. There you go. His old creepy self. Alright, let's go fight this guy. Oh, I should have switched to uh, Yagi. Well, I can do it. Oh, that sucks that I waste his turn. Go for Flame Whip again. So far, that doesn't seem like a bad action, man. I like that. It's pretty fair. Oh, it doesn't waste his turn. Uh... Do you think the sleep's interesting? I'll try it again. Oh, but it just hits one person. For some reason, I thought it hit multiple people. I forget, if I pass my turn to Yagi, does it waste a uh, Loaf's turn? Oh, well, I guess I won't find out now. Another level up. <laughs> wow. I guess I'll do Will up. Oh, I have to interact with it? Okay. Man, this place is huge. I really like the vastness of it. Um, well, since there's only two of them... Let's go for Fish Hammer. Oops, messed that one up a little. Although he's almost done, so it's fine. Yeah, it looks like this Bell has defense. That makes sense, he looks like he would. Something I can dig up. Or not me, but Lint can dig up. Oh, just that. I do hear a salamander. To the right of me? Yep. This one's a different color, too. It's a blue color. Is that the Thupka? I guess I'll get rid of. Cinnamon roll? I'm not really using that. Oh, my cursor's on screen again. My bad, guys. I haven't been really, like, touching my mouse at all, because I'm just using a... Oh, you know what it probably is? My, uh... Oh, I didn't know I can u move the screen with the right stick. Okay. Because, uh, I think sometimes the right stick on, uh, Steam Deck, at least on the desktop mode, well, sometimes activates the, uh, mouse. So maybe that might be what's happening. 
Let's go for a cliffhanger. Well, it won't kill the bell guy. It's interesting it still does one damage to him. I don't know if Paper Cut's gonna kill him. Oh, I messed up the action command there, but... I wonder if it would've done... the damage to kill him. Does this show what level loaf is at? 15. Wow. Well, the leveling in this game is kind of weird. Is that more mochi? I'll go so eat one of the mochi then. Did I... I feel like I'm missing something else though. I might have glossed over something. There's this guy down here. Also, I did hear another salamander snoring, so might be something else. I wonder if these guys have defense too. Let's go for Inferno. Those guys don't give it any experience, apparently. Okay, we can see. Oh, there's another item here, too. They're being pretty plentiful here. Oh, that's cool. Can I get a <laughs> inventory upgrade, too? I wonder how much I can get now. Well, maybe I'll have enough. Uh, if it'll give me 600, that means I can get Yagi once I get 600 um, clovers for that Yagi card. Okay, we need that chain upgrade, so I'm guessing a new partner. Gotta come back here. Where's that salamander? Maybe he's up there too? It's possible. Do I see one? Oh, he's over there. Yeah, I see him snoring with that little snot bubble. Okay, good thing I checked. Otherwise, I wouldn't have gotten that wallet upgrade. These guys give a lot of experience. I don't know if I said that, but these uh, ruckus drums, they give lots of experience. I guess because if you don't guard them, they can do four damage. Which is a lot. Go for the flame whip. Maybe I shouldn't have done Flame Whip if it's not going to kill them. No, no, I'm done. <laughs> I can't do numbers right now. Um... Guess HP? One thing I like is about the music here. Oh wait, boo! <laughs> I got them. <laughs> got, got them. I can now finally ascend. Yeah, th that's funny how they uh, said th that these guys are monks, or they're specific like slime enemy, slime creatures that they slowly uh, calcify and become statues. So that makes sense that. This guy would uh, still be alive, or at least conscious, and then before they could fully calcify, <laughs> they do something like that. That's funny. Is there anything over here? Oh, stuff look kind of weird there. I'm surprised he followed me all the way over there. I wasn't expecting him to navigate that way. 
Um, let's go for Inferno. Go for Saving Sword. I don't know why that action command always stops as soon as you hit green. I feel like it should let you fill it up. I just don't like being cut off, you know. Feels like I should be able to do just a little bit more. Is this guy still alive too? No. This one has ascended. The other one has ascended too, but it just needed to do one little prank before it could. Oh, the thing I was about to say, I think it was... Oh, that I like the music here because it adds a great amount of ambiance to the environment, but it also isn't too noisy. That it, it kind of, like, blends in well, and I could just keep listening to it on and on. But it all... Ooh, the monkey guy. Sunny. Whoa, there's so many of you this year. Pull up some cushions, little dude, while I roll out the rules. So first up... I'm Sunny, hey. I'm the first guardian. I love peaches and beaches and taking the easiest, fastest way through life's challenges. This year, I've got a rad agility test for you. So fun, you're not gonna wanna go on to the next room. Oh, there he is. I was wondering why it took a while to, uh, to continue to the next dialogue box. Hey, my guy, you're just in time. Clyde. Bully shouldn't be allowed to compete. Whoa, whoa. What's with all this negative energy? Everybody gets a fair chance here, my lanky dude. See? Er, now? See this little Nimbus cloud here? I'm gonna try to trip you up. If you're lying on your feet, you'll jump when it comes flying past your feet. You gotta get your timing right, though. Oh. Or it'll come around again and knock you flat. No extra points for stunts, even sick flips. Hovering or flying is a major note. You're up first, little dude. Oh, I see he's going around the little circle things. Kind of tricky. I think I got the hang of it now. This also kind of right reminds me of this one uh, chess video game I used to play as a kid. Uh, or checkers, I forget what. I'm gonna focus real quick. Oh, <laughs> I missed him right at the end. Um, it reminds me of this one uh, checker chess game where. Uh, I don't know if it was like Chinese checkers or something, but uh, they have these little like round things. I'll probably put it on the screen what game I'm talking about because I don't describe this well, but they had like these little balls and had weird patterns kind of like this. And this is like a very old game, like I think like Windows XP era, like when we had like a family computer. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I did a little jump there during the cutscene. Right on, little man. You really got into the flow. You passed my challenge. Go on down and see what Zuzu's cooked up for you. I also think it's interesting that I guess these guys are actual deities, or they be it's either they are deities or they became deities because to be able to live this long, I don't know. I assume it's been a long time since the Lamasary was created, so I'm assuming they're like ageless or something for them to still exist you're a big guy when you say jump i say ah. huh. <laughs> the guardian of agility can't even keep his balance ah. clan just killed sunny whoa no 
I'm okay, but that was deeply uncool, dude. Whatever. I never liked tests, hey. See you later, losers. Can he do that? Hmm. I guess that wasn't technically against the rules. Aw, oh, man. I'm gonna have to write more rules now. <laughs> okay, Sonny. Ah! <laughs> Sonny, get back up. I think he's still there. <laughs> 